everybody welcome back to my channel today i did a quick aldi's grocery shop and i popped in the top two because we had a specific coupon so i decided i would come on here and show you what we got this is not like a huge shopping trip um like we sometimes do but still you know big enough i think we got some good stuff so let me show you what we got so in no particular order just start over here by the meats we have of course the hot dogs Connor likes them. Charlotte is starting to take a liking to them. So I like to keep them um, in the freezer. It's not my favorite thing for them to have, but they're getting picky about food. So I don't know. I need to come up with something. And then we got some chicken. These are just the boneless, skinless thighs. We got some wings here. And then also some ground chicken, which we get instead of, we don't really buy ground beef. We don't really buy beef at all. And we use this for tacos. Anything you would use ground meat for is what we use that. And then I have the yogurts, which the kids love to snack on. And these yogurts were the last two in the cab and the and they were the last two in the cooler. And there was a woman behind me and she was saying, Okay, we gotta grab some yogurts. And then she like sucked her teeth when she saw I had grabbed the last two. But I mean, hey. <laughs> and then these are French toast sticks. The kids have that for breakfast, obviously. Connor wanted ice cream sandwiches. Normally, I get them the little freezy pop ice, ice, the popsicles. But he wanted to try this this time, so I said that was okay. And these tomatoes are really good. I like a nice, like, hard, almost hard tomato. I can't stand bushy tomatoes, so these are really good. They didn't have my um, tomato medley, the little multicolored grape tomatoes I usually get, so I got those. And then oranges, because the kids snack on fruit throughout the day. Stick with the fruit here. I got cherries. This is the first time I've seen the cherries in the store for this year, so I'm very excited. I hope they're sweet, um, but I really like those. And then I got some grapes, again, for the kids, you know, and their snacks. I'll keep across here. I always grab cucumbers because I like to slice them up with dinner. Um, me and Connor love those. And what else do we have here? That back corner right there, you can see bagels, cinnamon raisin, we got some curly fries. Uh, the kids really like these raviolis. Connor only likes the ones with the cheese in them. So we're gonna try this brand. Last time we tried a different brand, they liked them. So I'm gonna give those a try. We have two pasta sauces here. And we have the French onion dip, which the kids and I really love. We eat it with the plain potato chips. Got some ketchup. This I just picked up in Tops because I had a coupon. Um, it was on sale, so nothing special there. I grabbed that. We have some broccoli and some green beans. Come over here, your crinkle cut fries. Um, and then the little macaroni and cheeses. Um, again, the kids, sometimes they'll eat those. And so we'll see. Let me know what kind of things you make for your picky kids and what you can get them to eat because I'm running out of ideas. And then I got these hot spicy cheeses. I figured those would be good. And Connor likes garlic bread for dinner, so I picked this up. And uh, my husband likes the onion rings and then these are the chips for the dip. So that's everything I got at Aldi's. Now about this little story from top. So I got that ketchup and then my husband had gotten a coupon for diapers. It was $20 um towards diapers so that'll basically make the diapers free so i went in there i grabbed this one and then when i went to check out i noticed that it had this so instead of 24.99 they were on sale for 12.49 so i circled back around because i'm like okay i have a 20 dollars coupon i can't get the money back off of it the difference and excuse me so i didn't want to leave any of the money there so i grabbed a second box even though none of the other ones were marked and they were in the same place and excuse me, I went up to the register and I asked like, you know, these are the same diapers, why are they marked differently? Long story short, he didn't know. He got a manager who further didn't know. I didn't really like her attitude on top of it, but whatever. So I just took the one that was marked for 12.49, um, which was this one. And then to make up the difference, 
um, to get the full coupon, I added this. So we got these two here um, completely for free because we had the coupon. So yeah, let me know, does that happen ever? Like when you go to the store, if there's a, a section or a display of something, one, one, one is marked one way, one's marked the other way, or there's a sale sign or whatever, what do you do? Cause I felt like I was totally right to ask, like why are these identical items not the same price? But anyway, that is what we have for our grocery haul today. Thank you for watching and we will see you in our next video. Bye.